you can send automatic yet deeply personalized messages using custom variables. Custom variables allow you to turn any piece of information into part of your message. Let's take a look at how it works. Assuming that you've already added profiles to a queue, download a CSV file of it and save this file to your computer. Navigate to Excel and import the CSV file to it. Now, let's create a custom field. You should add a column where you put that piece of information that will become a custom variable. You can choose any name for a column. In my case, I'm creating custom variables with different guide names, which I'm offering to share with my leads. Save the file into a CSV format. Now we are going to upload the custom variables. Navigate to the plugin store, choose Message Actions Extensions, and make sure that Custom Template Variables plugin is installed. Go back to the campaign and navigate to the Actions queue where you want to upload custom variables. Click Custom Variables button and select the file with custom variables. After uploading a file, Select the appropriate column with custom variables. As you can see, the custom variables have been added successfully. Seems that I've forgotten to add a custom field for this profile. But that's okay. If the same happens to you, you don't need to do everything from scratch. We can open a profile, Add the appropriate variable, type the text, and click plus button. So, everything is set, and we can create a message with these custom variables. Go back to the workflow, and open Message Template Editor. You can type here your message. To add a newly created custom variable, hover over the text field and click on the custom variable button to select yours. In the preview section, you can check how custom variable fits into a message if you type any sentence here. You can also preview a message if you go back to the queue of the action. Let's check a few examples here. Now we can start the campaign. Let's take a look how Linked Helper uses the custom variables we created to make personalized messages. There are three levels of custom variables – Action Level, Campaign Level, and CRM Level. If you upload custom variables to a queue of one specific action, as I demonstrated before, 
these custom variables will be available only for this action. As you can see, this is an action level variable. To make custom variables available on a campaign level, so they can be used in other message actions, you should upload your custom variables to a campaign's queue. Switch to the list step, select the queue of your campaign, choose all profiles and click custom variables button to upload the CSV file with them. Now, the same variables are available on a campaign level. And if we add one more message action to this campaign, we can create a message with a custom variable too. If you upload custom variables to CRM, such custom variables will be applied to all your campaigns. Firstly, I will tag these profiles to easily find them in CRM. Then, navigate to the CRM tab and click Custom Variables button. Select the file and custom field that should be added. Now, if I filter profiles by tag, we can check that custom variables I applied and I can use them in all other campaigns. To check it, let's switch to a different campaign with the same profiles in queue. As you can see, the variables are available and we can use them in a message. One more thing to mention. When you upload a CSV file with profiles to your campaign, you are able to add custom variables as well. Click Upload Custom Variables button and select the fields that you want to be added as custom variables. And here are these custom variables that we selected to add.